Yo, it's Gerald Sweet Joe. In this video, I'm going to show you how to get the amulets of night power. Of course, you got to be a vampire, and you got to use your drain life spell, which is always equipped in your right hand on your enemies, to build up your vampire perks until you can unlock summon gargoyle, which probably probably should take about nine perk progressions, and then you go talk to Farron, and he, he'll give you the quest. What you want to do is save right before you turn in your last one and you go up to Farron to ask what you can do to help well met, sister. and if he doesn't give you the right quest well done. just reload until he you put those to gives pieces. you the amulets of night power quest speak with Vingalmo he has something for you if it doesn't work right, right away start another quest for a the little minute and then the reload of your vampiric powers all right, yeah, once you get this, it's going to send you to two different locations, each with its own amulet. Uh, for example, this is Golden Rock uh, Giant's Camp I got sent to. Remember to always save before this, because sometimes there'll be bugs and you can't get the amulet for some reason. But in Golden Rock, it's in this deceased master vampire body. Got the amulet of the gargoyle. A very nice amulet. Let's you summon an extra gargoyle for an additional 30 seconds. And the next one I get, I gotta go to Bone Strewn Crest with the dragon lighter. And I gotta fight an ancient dragon. Once defeated, look on his bot corpse. And you get the amulet of bats. Which is also another nice amulet. And that's how you get these amulets of night power. Like, subscribe, and enjoy. Oh yeah. Of course, before you keep them, go back to Castle Volkahair and talk to Farron to complete the quest. Hello there. And then they're all yours for the taking. Excellent. I'm sure you'll put those to good use. Yes, you will. All right, then. <clears throat> These are two unique amulets. You can only get as a vampire. Like, subscribe, and enjoy.